Welcome to Electron Online, and now we're going to talk about the frequency of visible light in a different way to so, so we can really get some appreciation for what that really is. Because it's really hard to imagine. The numbers are so large, it's hard to kind of comprehend how fast electromagnetic radiation actually vibrates. So, to try to help that out, let's take a simple piece of paper, and let's take our piece of paper and turn it sideways like this. So here's my piece of paper, I have a little bit of music on there, uh, but let's, all we're interested in is the thickness of the piece of paper. And typically speaking, the thickness of the piece of paper is roughly one-tenth of one millimeter, 0.1 millimeter, which would put it at one ten thousandth of a meter. And now imagine visible light, a ray of visible light, traveling through space past this piece of paper. Now imagine the speed of visible light is 186,000 miles per second, or 300,000 kilometers per second. So you imagine how little time light would spend traveling past the thickness of the piece of paper. Of course, you know that light will vibrate as it does so. The question is, in the time that it takes to travel from one side to the other side, this little thickness of the piece of paper, which is 0.1 millimeters thick, imagine how small a time that would be at 186,000 miles per second. How many times would light vibrate up and down during that period of time? Wow, well, let's see here. We have the equation distance equals velocity times time, which means time is equal to distance divided by velocity. So we take the thickness of the piece of paper, which is 0 0.0001 meter, a tenth of a millimeter, and we divide that by the speed of light, 3 times 10 to the 8 meters per second, which gives us 3.33 times 10 to the minus 13 seconds. That's a really small amount of time, less than a trillionth of a second amount of time that it takes for light to pass the thickness of the piece of paper. The number of waves that the light will go up and down is going to be equal to the frequency times the time that it takes to pass the paper. The frequency, 6 times 10 to the 14 per second or hertz, times 3.33 times 10 to the minus 13 seconds, and the answer, turns out, is 200 times, 200 waves. In the time that light takes to pass the thickness of this piece of paper, however small that time is, less than a trillionth of a second, it will go up and down 200, excuse me, I'm so excited about it, an enormous thing here, 200 times per second, which is just an incredible number of vibrations of light in that incredibly short amount of time. Electromagnetic radiation, really the frequencies are almost incomprehensible to human life. So there you go, that's what electromagnetic radiation is with these tremendously high frequencies. And so hopefully that gives you a better appreciation for what that really is.